Hey, welcome to the show. I'm the Crypto Kid. In these videos, we take a look at Bitcoin and everything that's going on in the world of cryptocurrency. So if you're new to the show, welcome. And if you're joining us again, welcome back. We make daily videos, keep it relevant to what's going on in the news. So let's jump right in. Let's take a look to see what's going on with Bitcoin coin itself bch now as you can see bitcoin cash is sitting at around fifteen hundred dollars and we're up and up here and we're trying to break through that sixteen hundred dollar mark currently and in the overall market it's looking pretty good we got green across the board iota is again jumping out and we've talked about this a few times and i mean remember when we were talking about that black friday price wow was that ever a deal because man we've seen some incredible gains and if you jump out to that view all that's going to show you the seven day trend show you exactly where we're sitting here uh, iota has hit 150 percent gains so anybody that uh that was listening and watched the video and actually picked some on that black friday congratulations because man i sure wish i had uh, but here we are. Uh, we got BTC chain sitting around 19% or let's say 20% over the last seven days. Otherwise, it's been a pretty green week here for cryptocurrency. Now, Bitcoin Cash has been hitting. Here we go, a new 24 hour high. And it's looking pretty good. I'm not too sure um, what we're talking about in terms of growth in the future, but we can be safe to say that over the next 24 hours, we should start seeing some. Uh, probably some consistency because we've broken through that $1,500 mark uh, very clearly here. And uh, it's going to be really exciting to see where we go over the next few days. Now, if we look over to BTC, um, you'll notice, oops, so let's jump back again here. You'll notice that we have been struggling to break through the $11,000 mark. Now, they're getting closer. I mean, we're up at around $11,600 currently right now. But the cool thing I wanted to mention is that tomorrow for Bitcoin Cash, there's some huge news because Bitstamp will be releasing access to BCH trading pairs, meaning you can take BCT, trade it with BCH online. You can also withdraw, store, or deposit um, funds and pick up some BCH through Bitstamp. So if you're not enrolled with Bitstamp, I would highly encourage you to do that now so you can get on board and get in there first because this is going to be huge because this is a massive player in terms of cryptocurrency. Let's see if that page loaded up. There we go. So if you jump over, you will see now this is BTC. You'll see Bitstamp right here. They're the number six contributor over the last 24 hours for volume. So Again, this is a massive move for BCH, and it is probably safe to say we will see some pretty nice gains over the next 12 hours because of this. Now, there's a wicked article I wanted to shed some light on, and I would encourage you to check out. This was on Bloomberg Business Week. Now, it's called Battle for the True Bitcoin, and it's just getting started. And isn't that the truth? Because we've been talking about this for two months, but now it's becoming more mainstream. People are starting to take a second look at this and say, hey, Wait a second, what's this Bitcoin Cash all about? Maybe it's not an altcoin. Maybe, you know, there's more to it than just uh, all the FUD that people have been spreading. And that is, in my opinion, so true. People are starting to understand that when the fork happened on August 1st, that Bitcoin Cash wasn't a forked altcoin. It was an upgrade to the chain. And the fact that the Segwit coin is considered Bitcoin, in my opinion, was the industry's biggest downfall. Because if Bitcoin Cash had been coined as the Bitcoin, and if Bitcoin Segwit would be called Bitcoin Core, Bitcoin Segwit, Bitcoin 2x, 1x, whatever you want to call it, it would not be considered Bitcoin. And if you watch yesterday's video when we go over why the white paper um, and what contributes or what incentivizes you to believe what Bitcoin is, you can see exactly what I'm talking about. So this is an article that I would highly recommend you check out because it's got a lot of facts. And not only that, there's a lot of good points in here that will allow you to look into your own research uh, so you can take some more time to, to, to investigate it and research it further. So again, I would highly encourage you to check that out. Um, and this is going to be a quick video today, but I just wanted to encourage you to check out uh, Bitstamp because tomorrow we are going to be seeing some pretty cool things. Now, I picked up a website. I'm sure you guys, if you're following me on Twitter, you've heard BitcoinCash.love. Now, what this is going to be all about, it's basically a Kickstarter that's funded by Bitcoin Cash. So it's for nonprofit, for humanitarian and environmental issues. 
Uh, if you've got a project that you want to spread the word for, so you want to build a school in Africa or you want to get some, some clean water to someone else in the other part of the world, you can fund it with Bitcoin Cash and we'll spread the rumors and the, and the truths about this and we'll get it going. Now, if you have any coders that want to get involved with this, please help me out. Uh, spread the word because I am uh, not a coder myself, but I would love the help to get this thing off the ground. And I'm working on a few websites. This is one of them. But majority of the work I'm doing is to promote Bitcoin Cash to help out uh, global acknowledgement or I should say awareness so everybody can get on board to take advantage of this financial freedom that clearly will be the future and possibility for everyone. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the show. I'm sure liking making these videos. And if you enjoyed it, please hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and we will see you in the next one.